the bottom line of privacy. You give information, unless you decide not to give any information, but that's not how most people are going to operate. Most people are going to say, I'll give some information, and you get services and you get a better user experience as a result. Putting profile information into, into Facebook, using Facebook at all, putting any information in there, doing Google searches, that gives you a lot of value. And in fact, as I've said before, a huge amount of value that you're not paying for. It doesn't cost anything. We've talked about the mechanics of Google. That's a huge amount of value that Google is giving you, and you're not paying anything for it. It's completely free, except for the information that you provide to Google. That's what, that's what you know, your eyeballs and your personal information are what you're giving back to Google. So it's your calculation. You do the math. What information do I want to give what am I getting back for it, and is it worth it? And unfortunately, there's no easy way around this. It's something you just have to think about, and you have to think about it on a case-by-case -case basis. So in the end, all of us need to come to some way of taking care of these issues, being able to understand how do I judge authority, how do I judge privacy, when do I give, give up information, when don't I give up information, do I trust these guys, do I not trust these guys, what would happen, what would be the worst case if this information got out, balanced against your ability, for example, in Google, to search the World Wide Web instantaneously with this really fantastic, amazing ability to get to the world's encyclopedia of information. Now, what's that worth to you? You do the math.